What's happening, everybody? Amp Capo here, Black Adonis Games. We are inside of Lyra Starter Game for Unreal Engine 5. Um, today is going to be a different type of video, guys. I'm going to show you guys a little bit of uh, what I've been doing, just an update of what I've been doing in my Lyra side of my project. And then I'm going to give you guys some good sites you can go to because i just haven't had time to do all the tutorials that i want to do um i did have these tutorials recorded and they got ruined but i'm going to give you guys sites to go to where you can um see and learn some of the things that i've done already okay so let's go in and first i just want to show you guys uh the new material what i've done um, I've definitely changed the color scheme here a little bit more, changed the backgrounds a little bit more here on the buttons. Um, when you go to uh, select character now, it's a lot better looking here. I revamped the uh, the icons here, the tiles for the character select. All right, so um, it's a lot better now. Um, I added a new character as well down here, Diablo. I'm um, still working on our hand IK. Um, the character's awesome though. The character looks awesome, but I'm just gotta work on the hand IK. But if you look here, just kind of customize this a lot more. Um, I'm gonna actually put in a little bit more work um, and see what I can get accomplished here. Um, we'll figure it out, guys. I was thinking of actually putting a uh, window through this where the character shows here because these characters are only allowed to show up to 512 uh i believe is the highest resolution you can show in the unreal engine ui at this time so they don't look really really good um and you can see it on some of these characters that the details are smoothed out so they don't look as nowhere near as nice as they do in the game so i'm probably thinking of maybe where this is just putting a hole through here a window and then having the character actually show up on the map so we'll see guys um but that's how that looks anyway guys um i did update those um and i'll show you guys uh that stuff for sure i'll try to get around to it but you guys are gonna want to check these other tutorials out first i also want to thank everybody who's been subscribing since the last time i put a video out guys i really appreciate it let's go ahead and go in um I just picked the, uh, I don't know who I picked. I thought I picked the mannequin character, but I might have, I don't know who I clicked on. Yeah, so I'm still um, Quinn. And there's a reason because I'm still working out some of the slot information for the holsters for the other characters and getting them to be customizable per character. So I'm not going to get into anything here yet. I'm just going to let this timer go by. But I've done a lot of additions to the map as well. Um, added some more buildings farther over and just put more details in. Um, I'm probably going to not have as many spawnables. I mean, spawned uh, weapons. I'm not sure how I'm going to do that yet. But as you can see here, these guys just robbed me. So I'm going to just go ahead ahead of them to the next one, see if I can beat them to it. Um, but I redid some of the shaders, um, reshaded the sky some um the purple clouds as you can see here now that i have the um uh, rifle that the pistol's on her hip now so it looks really good um i got this from i got this actually from another tutorial from someone else i thought it was awesome i was looking for something else that had to do with weapons and i just came across this and that's why exactly guys i decided to do a series um, on hot websites for people that are trying to code uh, in a Lyra starter game. Um, let's see here. I added new beasts, so you can see my new beasts are here. They actually have a skin underneath a bunch of armor. They have their own unique death. So you can see there, he took off, bounced off the building. There you go. So there you go, it looks really good. All right, so this character here, she just dropped them already, but she dropped smaller uh, versions of the monsters. That's what they are right now. I'm gonna actually make them into their own little characters, but right now I'm just, uh, she's just dropping mini versions of the larger monsters. Um, the small ones are pretty cool. Um, I changed the effects so that they have seem smaller. I got everybody yeah all right and so it's running pretty smooth guys um there's a little glitch here and there to be expected um and i do have a little just a tiny bit of code cleaning still to do 
Um, I'm getting one error, and I think I just figured out what it was. So I'll go check that out and see if I'm right. I also have a uh, the health pack that you can carry now and put it in uh, on your hip and all that. But it turns into a gun, and I think that's why I get an error that the mesh is not correct. So we'll figure it out. Can't believe no one shot at her. But you can see the weapon spawn. Those guys picked it up and and left the traded it out for the uh, pistol. There, you see. So there you go. But everything's running real uh, well, guys. Um, right now, I've reduced it down to 1080p because um, I'm really not show showing it right now. I'm just kind of letting you guys see what's happening here. But there you go, and there's weapons. Um, and there should be health as well. So there we go, I just got my health up. And the weapons are set to disappear after one minute. So after a minute, those weapons are going to be gone. So if no one gets them within a minute, you're not going to get them. All right, but it's pretty cool. And you can see I got two slots full. All these weapons are weapons I already have. You can see here the weapons are going to start disappearing. And I'm just waiting around for those weapons so you guys could really see them vanish here, which they should any second. Yep, there, there they go. There's one. And it doesn't affect. There it goes. When the weapons disappear, that's the effect that they play. So. So there we go. That's a pretty death, man. All right, but it looks amazing, guys. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just, I'm gonna go ahead and stop playing. Um, I want to give you guys the info, but I did want to show you guys like kind of what you you know what you'll be getting out of it. Um, let me go here and grab this. And you can see I got a holster on the back there. And so if I trade weapons out, what I want to prevent is that big weapon going on the hip there. I'm gonna uh, set it up so that only the small handgun sized weapons can go there because i might have like little uzis and stuff like that who knows but all these weapons are going to change to sci-fi versions they're not going to be these versions they'll be the same versions that i'm using from a uh, third person shooter kit the, the weapon skins will be the same skins and there she just spawned the characters there so that's the new character um i have two versions i have a version of the character you can play with uh, as the player and then a beast version that is an enemy and that's the one that spawns these little guys all right so all right guys i'm gonna man i'll sit here and play all day i just like to watch the little ones when they die it's hilarious So let's go ahead. I'm gonna get out now. I just hate losing. You see, I'm I'm playing until I can get somewhere where they can't hurt me. So I just hate losing. Man. Ooh. All right. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna get out of the game now. We're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna let you guys check out the sites that I've chosen here for my two sites of the week. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna get this all the way turned off here. So we're just going to quit. Yeah, we're going to quit. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the sites. All right. The first site I wanted to show you guys is called Ren Kylo. Um, the site is in Russian. All of the tutorials are in Russian, but you can follow them, guys. Like, it's not so serious that you can't follow them. This is where you can get the uh, drop weapon from slot, which allows you to drop the individual weapons. And then also there's another one here, uh, Weapon Holsters, okay? So these are two really good ones. He has other ones I haven't checked out, but this, these are things that I was already working on and, you know, it was right up my alley and just helped me to really make things smoother than the way I had them. I didn't have them nowhere near as smooth as uh, 
Ren, Kylo did. So go there. Make sure you subscribe, guys. Don't go there and not subscribe, man. Subscribe to the channel. All right. Um, it's good information, man. And, and, and this guy's really cool. And if you got questions, you can ask them in English. He will answer them. Um, it's just that these videos are in Russian. All right. But they're very easy to follow. Very easy to follow. And you might learn a little Russian. Who knows? All right. So the next one is going to be here. It's going to be Nance Dev Diaries. And this one is really good. She does a lot of good work. And um, the tutorials that you can get out of here are the inventory collectibles. She's not going to show you everything to get it all the way the way mine are. But this is a good tutorial. There was no need for me to make one when I saw this one. I looked this up after I already did partially had my to mine done but she helped me to figure out a few things that were kind of glitchy with it and this is a really good 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 tutorials here um you guys want to check out all of these these are all really good i haven't checked out the ability rolling yet but i'm, I'm i already know how to do those things but i'm still going to check her version out because like i said sometimes someone has an easier or a different method that may be more suited to what you're trying to do or, or what you're trying to put in your project. All right, guys. So these are the two sites for the week, man. I'm, like I said, guys, I've been trying to stay on task. I've been doing tutorials, but I'm not going to be able to do all of the tutorials. So I will at least point you in a direction so that you can uh, get the knowledge that you need. So remember, we got Ren Kylo and Nance Dev Diaries. Go check those sites out, guys. Subscribe to them. And... Um, that's pretty much it for today, man. I'll try to do these every week, man. I've been looking up a lot of new information and coming across a lot of cool tutorials that are even helping me to speed my process along. All right, guys. So that's it from me, man. Amp Capo, Black Adonis Games, man. Like, subscribe, tell a friend, and remember, check out those sites and like and subscribe to those sites as well, man. Good information. It's all about the community, man.